we're going to have a two-phase algorithm, but the algorithm needs to be initialized. And we initialize it by building a long path. And this is done with an absolutely greedy process. So you reach into your data set and grab any vertex whatsoever, 27. You, you could get this vertex from the first line in the file. I mean, OK, so the first line is the number of vertices, 683. Now, you're going to read the second line, and it's got 2782. Good. 2782, that's my starting. Now, try to extend this path. I've got endpoints 27 and 82. So I just read down the file until I find a line with either 27 or 82 on it. Maybe I see 82, 96. Good. Now my endpoints are 27 and 96. I keep reading until I find, start at the top again, and read until you find a line which has one of these guys on it, and one that's not in my list to this point. Maybe I find one here. Maybe it's 17. Uh, these numbers can go up and down and up and down because I, there's no restriction on how the lines in the file are given. So now my endpoints are 27 and 17. I read until I find one. Maybe I find 108. Then I read. Maybe I find 104. Now I read. Maybe I find... 52. I keep reading. 93. I keep reading. 66. And I, I, I keep this process up until it halts. Now, what, what do you mean it halts? I, I, I don't see a way to extend it. I, I've got endpoints 93 and 66, and I read the file looking for a neighbor of this that isn't in my list, and there aren't any. And there are no neighbors of 66 which aren't in the list. Now, what does that mean? Where are the neighbors of 93? They're on a path. Now, all the neighbors of 93 are, are over here somewhere. So I, if I try to extend the path by going from 93, I can't. And the same thing for 66. All the neighbors of 66 are on the path. Wait a minute. So what was the condition about degree? Every vertex has more than half the vertices as neighbors. So that means that the number of neighbors, that one, that one, that one, that one, and that one, of 93, those vertices together are more than half. And you've got 93. So you've got 1 plus more than half. That's a pretty long path. If n is a million, I, I, I've got a path here which is at least a half a million plus 1. OK? It's just a long path. But I, I'm, not, I'm not trying to get a long path. I'm trying to get a cycle that touches everything. <laughs> But now I have my algorithm initialized, and I, so I have a long path, and very important, that this long path is, at, is bigger than half. So there, there's lots of other, well, there's, in general, there's lots of other vertices, and there's lots of other edges, but there's more on the path than not on the path. Is that clear? More on the path than not on the path. Okay. Now, let's go to phase one. Now we've initialized it, let's go to phase one. <laughs>